You could like lose this round something or whatever. Yeah, it's up to you. Give me your line. Do your brackets. Alright, so round one between Chemo and uh, Contusions is gonna be on Smashville. Chemo and Contusions. Can you change the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Alright, this is Chemo and Contusions. Zero, zero, up to eight. Nice. All right, you commentate for a bit. I'm gonna check out where we are in the bracket. All right, so Toon Link Dark Pit, uh, interesting matchup. So Toon Link is just gonna be throwing out a lot of projectiles, as you've been seeing right now. Uh, he gets an up smash on the Toon Link, right? And yeah, right now it looks like the Toon Link is just kind of spacing things out. Oh, gets punished for throwing out the grab. Should I call like the round here? What do you mean? Like, well, loses quarterfinals. Yeah, you can do that. Ooh, gets him with the back throw. Has stage control, but... Ooh, the side B coming in. Reflecting the bomb right back at Confusions. Okay. Looks like Kimo's tying it up a little bit, bit by bit. Bit by hit. <coughs> Ooh, actually with the lead right now. One thing Kimo has to watch out for is these bomb conversions by Contusions. He is a master at getting them. And fair with Toon Link and, and up air as well are both extremely good kill moves. Kills very early off the top and to the side. Almost gets, gets it, it there. Right there. Another good thing about Toon Link's up air is that it actually outlasts uh, air dodges, so it's a good covering tool. If he follows the eye. Oh, oh. oh. Ah, Not from across the stage, though. Very close. Contusions was talking before about like um, forward air and back air, and, like how strong was each other, how strong were they? And he said that forward air is stronger than back air by a margin, but it's just, that electric shark arm is stronger than any move Toon Link has. Out of his normals, anyway. That forward smash, though. Yeah, but that forward smash. Very powerful. Okay, tech chase with the dash attack. Let's see his guy. Oh, oh, double spot dodge. Gets him. Ah, spaghetti! Ooh, spaghetti. <laughs> no punishes anywhere. Alright, dash attack, just get him off stage. Ooh. Reflects the. Oh, oh, it does it again. That could have been something amazing. Something to know about Kimo, he's the master of side B. He, uh. Doesn't throw it out liberally, but he throws it out enough to where, you know. Oh, he throws it out pretty liberally. Yeah. A lot. <laughs> oh, bomb? Nothing. Uh, those are the interactions I hate the most in this game, where someone whiffs a snatch attack on shield when they're at the ledge and they spot dodge, and then it's just both players oh, trying yeah, to yeah. hit each other. It's so confusing. Kimo extending this lead. Oh, oh not commentator's curse, baby. <laughs> Well, he still has the lead, and he's going to continue to try to extend it, but that stock was just deleted by that forward. Yeah, hand. stocks in this game are super duper important to get. Because per getting percent, I feel like, isn't that hard, but getting the stock is always a struggle for right. most characters in this game. Because most characters in this game have, like, real good cookie-cutter combos. Like, you know, they can... Oh! Almost gets oh the down air! Hits him with... Oh. 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 Uh, good, good read on the roll with the up, sma uh, up, up special by Toon Link. Yeah, like we were saying before, like getting percent in this game isn't much of an issue unless you're maybe playing Sheik, because like, and you're not, you don't have any moves to contest with her. But you know, just taking the stocks is what really matters. In yeah, this game, for the most part, like you need heavy commitments with a lot of characters to get stocks. Right. Ooh, but nice conversions. He's actually bringing this back really well. Ah. Almost gets the bomb combo there. Only down about forty percent. Forward smash could kill at the ledge at any point now for both characters. What? Ooh. That's a oh, where's the jump? Very good up smash, covering the jump by Kimo. This one, it was powerful, very powerful. Now up one zero in this best of three. Now I do know that these two players are two two in sets. The game just now was pretty close. Uh, I expect the same for throughout the rest of the set. Now let's see what. Oh, All right. back to Smashville. It was back to Smashville, saying, you know what, stage isn't really what happened, I just gotta play better, and I respect that. Not, not a lot of people would like to go back to the same stage that they lost on. <laughs> Ooh. Little tech demo right here. Oh, I guess it oh, here. high level Smash play. <laughs> was that Boomerang into forward smash? I think it was. Up throw. Ah. Uh, one thing that Kimo does a lot, and most... Uh, so, so do a lot of other pits, is that whenever they feel threatened, they just jump out of any sort of predicament. 
yeah. which is good in and of itself, but if someone catches onto that, they can get punished hard by a hard hitting up air. Unless it's a true combo, nothing is the best option in this game. Uh, Though some, can, some can be better than others. Yeah. But if you have the read, chances are you're getting punished. Or if you have the read, you're getting the punish. Right. Fourth throw. Wow, really Contusion. big lead, actually. Contusion is just almost getting 100% more on Kimo. Oh. Actually, more than 100 now. Uh, try to go for the down smash to cover a roll. Ooh, he's at the ledge again. This is where Kimo's been getting a lot of his percent, especially in the previous game. Now, Kimo, gonna have to... Kimo isn't really going up to edge guard Toon Link, per se, because he's really, yeah, just like that, because Toon Link has a tether grab, and that lets him just instantly zip to the stage whenever he feels like he's in trouble. Ooh, he's getting a lot of mileage off this corner, though. All right, invincibility's run out. A lot of these ledge options are just getting stuffed out, and he's getting he's gonna fall back off the stage right, right there. He oh, fell off the stage. Yeah. Oh, oh, goes to the edge guard. Ow. Now Confusion's the one with stage control, instantly losing it again. Oh, is that it? Nope. Wow. Amazing DI, and our stream is a little Poopy. wonky. Lime, where are you? We need help. <coughs> Where's mine? Like, I hope this isn't going to be in the VODs. Is this the new patch? 1.1.7? <laughs> Visual upgrades? Constant frame buffering? Oh my god. Like, what, what's happening? Look at this bit rated so... Yeah. Where's, where's mine? Well, regardless, it looks like Kimo has a stock lead right now. Getting a little bit of extra credit right now. Oh my god. Stuck at the ledge again. Oh my gosh. Confusions can just not get back to stage. The moment he's on the ledge, he just takes so much. He's taking 44 off of this one. You know, I, I can't tell which stage options he's going for and like which ones he can mix up because like this. Are, if you see what we're seeing, this is garbage. I'm not even sure what to say. Uh, Kimo up in the air. Tries to electroshock to the ledge. Actually does it. Damage. He got oh. stuck. All right. Bomb the forward air. Classic. Now, this isn't too much of a deficit for Toon Link. He can do a lot of damage in a short amount of time. Yeah, the big problem, though, is the consistent issue seems to be just whenever he's on the ledge, he just keeps on getting back off the stage over and over again. Kimo doing an amazing job of just controlling the stage. I think uh, Contusions at this point has to try to play very non-committal because he's been going through these up smashes and these smash reads. And yeah. He's just been getting punished for it. He just needs damage. What he was doing on the platform was a good strategy. <coughs> Just pulling bombs and throwing them off, like sort of creating a wall. Okay, oh, the, the stream. Oh, okay, it fixed We're itself. Good. See, like right there, he, he made a huge commitment on that up smash read, but and he just got thrown off the stage. He just needs percent, doesn't need a big hit right now. Okay, he's doing a good job, has center stage. Meanwhile, he's not really at four throw percent right now. So, Kimo kind of either has to go for a hard commitment, or he's just going to have to keep chipping away. But Toon Link, I would say, is much better at getting that small damage consistently. I'd say that a lot of people in this area have pro problems with commitment in this game. Oh, good, good conversion off of the boomerang. Would you like to uh, talk about that a little more? I know me personally, I try to... Oh, oh the back throw with Rage, killing him off the side. Right there, that, that's what I was going um, to touch on just now. Um, Kimo had a feeling that he was going to get that grab and maybe get the kill, but he committed way too hard. He didn't try to bait out an option from Toon Link. Maybe, maybe he should have short hopped. Maybe he should have done something to make Toon Link commit and then get the punish. That's what a lot of people in this area have problems with. They just want to go right in and get the punish, but you have to, uh, you have to bait out a commitment from the other player. Oh, you're right. Yeah, I mean, and grabs in particular in this game are a very strong option, especially because shield's such a good option in general. Mm -hmm. But, you know, grabs do have over, like, 20 frames of lag at the end of them. Pretty pretty easy to punish. Shoutouts to the one viewer. That's probably us. So oh, far... Oh, Trump was watching, too. Sweet. So far, oh, pretty even game so far. Actually, completely even. Oh, he re oh. the ledge, but no punish. Maybe he was trying to go for a, a wall jump, maybe. Okay, oh, get the little, little bomb up smash. Nice. Ooh, has stage control. See how Kimo can get back to stage. 
This could be sort of a YOLO option, but if Kimo actually tries to um, side beat to the stage with the Electroshock, maybe uh, Contusions can get a down air and try to spike him out of the animation. Ooh, Contusions literally just forced him from one side to the other side with his uh, projectile pressure. Contusions doing a great job just spacing out Kimo, saying, you need to come to me. My projectiles are better than yours. I can move with them. I can do a lot of other things. Kimo struggling to get in. Ooh, Ooh nice big down, down air. air. Kimo on the ledge once again. Ah, maybe if it was Link and his sword was huge, that would have killed. I but think he wanted an up air. I think the up smash might have been a missed input. Maybe. But that up, was that up smash? Yeah. Up smash taking the taking the stock for contusions. Yeah, up, to Toon Link's up smash and up tilt almost look the exact same. It's absurd. Okay. Ooh, up B. Hanging on to this lead of his tournament's this tournament game right here. At this point, he can be extremely non-committal because an entire stock lead is huge. To an extent, because um, if Kimo reads a bad option and gets a side B on one side of the stage, that could end Doom for, that could spell Doom for Contusions. This also being Battlefield though, where the blast zones are fairly large in comparison to the rest of the stages in the game. Yes, I'm pretty sure if this was like Smash Bros or something, that boy Smash might have killed actually. Right. And Kimo actually with no rage, so that would have been a uh, vanilla, I guess, forward smash to kill. Just hanging on, baiting out time. Doing the hanging, man. No, oh, tries Ooh. to go for the grab, maybe go for an up throw up air. On the corner once again, this is a dangerous spot. Ooh, oh, air the grab. Air up to the ground, that was a bad decision. Oh, now he's up smash. Arrow Just, to up smash? I mean. Anything's possible if you believe, right? <laughs> you just gotta believe! Oh, Kimo at the God percent. Now he lost it. Super lost it. Now he's at 9 times 9 percent. Okay, Kimo's got a decent amount of rage with him right now, so Ooh. this isn't too out of the out of the mind, out of out of the imagination. He's just committing so hard, right? Like, and he, Contusions is punishing all of his attempts. Yeah, that's death. He's, he's not all Battlefield, oh, baby! That? Again. Yeah, I, I guess that was from the center of the stage. Ooh. Oh, okay. Tries to read a roll or something with that board. Punishes though. the commitment. Good job, Akimo. 97% deficit. Pretty big. Especially considering Toon Link's potential kill power, but... You know. Akimo practicing his perfect shields over there. Uh, shield pressure. <laughs> Contusion's yet to take a single percent on this fresh stock. Of yeah, he's just... Oh, oh, is that it? No, oh. no rage. The Battlefield counterpick is helping out Akimo very, very well. Power shields the bomb, no punish. Back throw. Oh. oh, is that a punish? No, once again, just grab and then spot dodge. Yeah, being aware of the exact frames you can punish something can be pretty difficult. Right. Commits, gets punished. Both these players oh. want this to end right now, <coughs> but one of them has to work harder than the other. At 50%, Dark Pit doesn't have the greatest killing power in the world either. He ha does have a lot of rage though. Who's gonna win this tie-breaking set? Who's gonna go 3-2 against over the other? <coughs> Just these bomb pressure. Oh, oh, oh almost gets the forward smash. Bomb? Ooh. Boomerang. Oh, oh. back here. That's oh, it off that the takes top. It. Oh my god. Good and job to contagion. 2-1. Good job for Contusions, taking that game. 